in Paul. The Church of Rome teaches. For 65 years, he preached three times a week, including twice on a Sunday. Whether you be religious or irreligious, it matters not. You were born naturally as a child of wrath. Ian Paisley delivered his first sermon back in 1946. He quickly rose to prominence in the pulpit and in politics. Never! 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 He founded his own Protestant fundamentalist church. He used his position as a member of the European Parliament to confront the Pope. Few could have imagined that the once divisive figure would end up as a popular First Minister of Northern Ireland. Throughout it all, he kept preaching. Father, dismiss us with thy blessing. Keep but now at the age of 85, he's decided to retire from his church duties. He'll deliver his final sermon at his South Belfast church next month. Sundays here will never quite be the same again. But his family say he'll never completely retire. I see this, I suppose, as the, not the closing of a life story, but the opening of a new chapter, Paisley, the retirement years. And I know that he has ambitions for things to do, namely write his autobiography, and I hope that will be a humdinger when it comes out. It seems Ian Paisley is not ready for the quiet life just yet. Mark Simpson, BBC News, Belfast.